Oh, I'm dead. Remember me as I was? Alrighty, friendos, welcome in. So in today's video, my Twitch viewers somehow convinced me to play 24 times difficulty on Prism Map. I don't think I've ever played 24 times on Prism before. Obviously, I've done my Apocalypse Challenge on Asylum. I have the gold trophy and whatnot, but I've never done it on Prison. So if you're not familiar with what the 24 times challenge is, basically it's like the hardest difficulty. So you're at 50% speed. The ghost is at 150% speed. You have zero evidence no flashlight, breakers off, and a whole lot of other miserable things. So here is a gameplay of me playing 24 times on prison. And honestly, it went about as well as you could expect. If you enjoyed the video, definitely drop it a like. Let's see if we can get this video up to 50 likes. That would help me out so much. If you love the video, drop me a sub. Otherwise, let's hop into some gameplay. Okay, there you go. Okay, I've never done 24 times in uh, prison. This should be interesting. Whoa, dude, slow down, bro. What else do I want to take? I think a camera. I'll try to get the picture, maybe. Day 94. I was trying to approach the prison. And I was unable. Okay, I might be able to get this done. Okay, time to die. Where am I? This um, table will protect us, right? Actually, I have a better idea where I want to go. The ghost isn't on top of me right now. Um, yeah, everyone put your listening ears on. Dude, it's totally gonna be an A or B block, right? Okay. Yeah, I don't hear it at all. <sighs> oh, you mean TSW? I'm so fast. What was that noise? You guys like this nothingness on screen right now? Because I do too. I am assuming and probably very. Horribly assuming the ghost is here. The ghost is here. Uh, well, we'll check both blocks. Both A and B block. Wait, oh. I was like, why is there rain? There's holes in the ceiling. Dude, that's such a poor building design. This is not actually a hiding spot, but I'm gonna try to make it one, okay? Thank you. Can you ask CJ to make this a hiding spot? Make these hiding spots, please? Anyone? Mm. CBD, that's what I need you to do for me. Could you go in prison and find hiding spots in A and B block for me? Uh, okay, we'll stay here for like a minute or so and see if it's here. If you want to, you don't have to, but if you want to, CBD. Because you're so good at finding hiding spots. Okay, uh, tomorrow works. All out tomorrow. So the prison doors, the ghost can't see you through them. Um. So like as long as the ghost doesn't come in here, I'm probably safe, but... I don't hear it over here. I don't think it's over here. It's gonna be an A block, right? All right, to A block we go. So far, not getting Phantom Ray Banshee vibes. It hasn't done anything near us. Could be Miling. True, I definitely could be. Oh, Jesus. I hear it. I hear it. I hear it. It's upstairs. Oh, Lord. Oh, lordy. Okay, are you done hunting? No. Yeah, I don't like to put the brightness out. I, when I first started doing my 24 times, I did, but I don't anymore. Um, okay, we actually might be able to use the bathrooms to hide. Might being the keyword. Now we walk out with our smudge stick for safety. I 
It sounded fast. <laughs> <laughs> but like, I think it, it sounded normal under 50 cent speed though. So these aren't super safe. By the way, I'm actually hiding out in the first one. Maybe we'll go in this one. I have died in here before, but we're gonna try it. I mean, do not big maps, so I don't really know. Okay, true. Yeah, no, I mean, there's nothing wrong with doing it, playing with higher brightness. I mean, I do play on two, two brightness. That's a ghost, all right. I want to try a hiding spot, actually. That's like closer to the ghost. Um, yeah, let's try this. Because I think it's over here somewhere. I thought I could probably get the ghost to go in the bathroom. For science, we'll go over here. Yeah, just do something to my right. It might be an infirmary. I want to see. Can I hide? Ooh, this is probably not a very good hiding spot. I imagine the ghost comes all the way in here. Yes, we're doing ghost signs, not the flammable kind. Prison can definitely be a little bit disorienting, but like once you learn the layout, it's pretty self-explanatory, right? Like you come in, you have the, you have the like visitors area. And then when you go in, you have like straight ahead, you have like the cafeteria library, but then left and right, you have AB block and you go upstairs you have the bathrooms, then you have like the office area, and then you go further back, you have like the warden's office, the infirmary. So once you like kind of know the general layout, it's not bad. Am I dead? No. Wait, can I see it through here? Ooh, no, it's like kind of opaque. All right, I want to see if I can get away with this hiding spot. I don't think I can. Because I think the ghost might path in here, but we'll see. I have no idea what this ghost is, by the way. <clears throat> You've got to be kidding me. I was going to take a picture of it. Oh, I hate it here. Okay. Let's go get another smudge stick. <laughs> Maybe I'll set a timer, actually. Maybe I'll set a timer. I don't know if I was technically in the same room as it, though. Wait, did I escape the- I might have escaped the ghost during the hunt and repelled it with a smudge stick. Did I get those done? <gasps> did it. So good, this game. I can leave now, right? It's clearly a Gorio. Kidding, I have no idea what the fuck it is. Oh, I'm so slow. Why did you let me do this? Okay, so probably not a demon. It's been about 90 seconds since I smudged it. Okay, we're gonna go back in with... Um... This? Oh, well, maybe a crucifix, and then... We need another smudge stick, right? Okay, so we don't have a lighter on us, which is bad news bears, but we're gonna make it work. Yeah, I, like, not using the same hiding spot twice is a pretty fun challenge. Yeah, I feel like, yeah, Blazio's got a lot of sneaky hiding spots. Grafton too. So you could probably get away with a lot on Grafton. <clears throat> okay. Let's see if it's a spirit. It's been two and a half minutes since I smudged it. Hmm. Promising. <clears throat> okay, not a spirit. We're gonna hide over here. I gotta show you the poop hiding spot. So if you go upstairs in Pleasedale, second floor, um, very last room at the end of the hallway. So like you have, you have the bathroom on your left and then you have two bedrooms at the very end. The one on the right, there's a mannequin in there. Granted, I don't know if the ghost moves it or not, but um, yeah, you can hide behind that mannequin. Just put your face right in the tatas and yeah, the ghost can't see you. <clears throat> Maybe we'll walk out with the crucifix. That'll save us, right? I might wait for one more hunt before I go 
near the ghost room. That was a good idea. I do believe it's hunting. <clears throat> or I'm paranoid. Or both. <clears throat> yeah, there's a hiding spot. I don't think it's supposed to be, but the ghost can't see you there. Let's go in. It's interesting that it opens, it touches the bathroom stall as it's going down the stairs, like through the wall. I think it's still hunting, but I just want to flick the light to see. This would probably be a safer spot. I want to test that one spot though, that I was in. I may die. The, I mean, I'm okay with it becoming a Dio and then realizing it's a mimic. Okay, it's done. Let's try to get over to our spot. How is this gameplay for you guys? Is it, it being like really dark, is that boring? Or does it not matter? I've always wondered. I, I usually try to play with the light source so you guys can see. Oh, I'm dead. Remember me as I was? Goodbye, world. No. Uh, okay, we'll try it again. We'll try it again. Oh, she was kind of lit up a bit, so it's not pitch black. Okay. It's immersive. Okay. That might, I didn't actually get to go to the hiding spot. I think the ghost just saw me go in here. What was it? Oh, it was an Oni. I probably could have right. figured that out, maybe. All right, let's try it again. I got 105 XP, let's go. Dude, whenever we first played Phas Phasma, we all, we all thought the crucifix saved us during a hunt, right? Actually, let me grab my coffee real quick and then we'll get in this game. Give me like two minutes to grab it. Okay, I'm back, sorry. Thank you for your, oh God, I just spilled crystal light on my desk. Oops, oopsie poopsie. Did I do that? <sighs> do, 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 do. I found a school that will teach me the ways of paranormal science. Really? <laughs> How much? Okay, I'm going with the same strategy. Okay, I'm actually going to try this time, right? <clears throat> and I think after we do, either I give up or we successfully guess the go get the ghost right, I'm going to swap the Conrad Stevenson's paranormal PI. I'm so paranoid, I always have to check for my lighter. If you ever see me swap for my items, it's because I'm making sure I have a lighter. Oh, actually, no, we're gonna hide. This is gonna be our spot. We're gonna hide in. At the start. 12k a year? Sheesh. You went to that school and it costs the exact, exact same as a half quarter of weed, okay. Demonology and stuff? Ooh. Okay, I don't hear the ghost over here. Could be a sneaky upstairs ghost. Sit by the light switch. I think it's a Dio. It is. Oh my god, it's a Dio. Oh my god, it's a Dio. Oh my god, it's a Dio. What else do we have to do? Okay. <clears throat> Unless it's a mimic. Oh my god, we got a Dio. Oh my god. Let's go. Okay. Let's go. We did it. We're the best. We're so good at this game. Dio's good. You can still outwalk a Dio in this difficulty. I actually want to grab dots as well so I can see. We need this. I'm going to grab this much like, just in case. Yeah, I'm gonna go back up dots because I'm gonna probably loop it here. Like in this this entryway. <clears throat> Try to get the picture and stuff. And the smudge like, like just yeah, we have dots there and smudge like just in case I fuck up. Maybe more candles so I can see. So we wanted more candles and then dots. Okay. This copy is so good. Okay. <clears throat> I can't, I don't know where I put my lighter though. Oh, there it is, okay. Put the dots down. And I put them, see, can I put them on the chairs? That would be ideal. Can I put them on the, I don't want to try to put them on the ceiling. Let's see, can I put them right here? <gasps> okay, that's pretty good. Wait, I want to put them a little bit higher maybe? Okay, I wish I had one more set of dots, but I'm cheap and I didn't bring another set. Maybe some candles, if the ghost will allow us. All the light sources. <laughs> <clears throat> OK. 
Okay, one candle. Yeah, we're gonna try to get this ghost blood a candle when it's like loop chasing us here. Hopefully it's still a Dio and not a mimic. Let's put the other two candles over here because it's kind of dark over here. Okay. Steel's really giving me time to set up. I really appreciate it. All right, we can see everything now, right? And I get the paramic before it tries to kill me. Okay. <clears throat> Moment of truth. Is it still a Dio? Stop that. Still a Dio. One of those surely counted, right? Blow out a candle. Ah, yeah. I got the, okay, the first picture I got it. Let's go. Okay. So now he's got to get to talk to us, and we need to blow out a candle. Which we should hopefully do every time it comes over here. This might take a couple, a couple sashes. It's coming from, like, that way, right? Might get a little bit braver and try to get closer to where it might be. I need more lightning, please. That was nice. I could see everything. I wonder if it's in like A block, maybe? I just like don't want to go over there and get too close and then I can't see where I'm going and I run into a wall and die. Let me just try to get the paramic while it <clears throat> is chasing me. Nice, we got the paramic. Okay, now we're saying to get to blow out a candle. Please blow out a candle. At your earliest convenience. No rush. Did it just blow it out before? No, it just went out naturally. Maybe I'll hold one of these candles. You know you wanna. Wait, that I don't wanna also just went out naturally, okay. Yeah, candles do just go out like on their own. So the ghost doesn't always blow them out. After a while, they just eventually go out like that. Right, yeah. We got so lucky. <laughs> Good so lucky to do. I can't believe it. I love how it's so fast when it comes in here. You see how it like can't control its speed and it like runs into the wall. Dude, that's so funny. That's why sometimes you can get away with looping a really fast ghost because it just runs into the wall and slows itself down. Please blow out a candle. I don't ask. Oh, I think it just did. <gasps> Let's go. We did it. 24 times. Prison. First try. <laughs> First try, hardest ghost possibly that you can get on 24 times. It's that easy. Getting your apocalypse trophy is that easy. <laughs> I'm excited to see how much money we're gonna make. Um, <clears throat> only we found the bone. We're also getting robbed here because we're only gonna get a 15 times multiplier. That's okay. It's not like we're super hurt for money or anything, right? Alright, let's see. Yeah, they're locked, right? Alright. The bone would be like, ooh, I don't know. Welcome back. I've got some jobs I think the bone's maybe twenty dollars in this map. Let's see. Well, I don't know. Then yeah. Ooh, fifteen twenty. Do you have money? Send me go to school. Okay, I'll I'll start saving up to send you to go to school. Well, there you go. <laughs> I mean, the guy kind of felt like cheating because it was a deal, but yeah.